War for the Planet of the Apes is a 2017 American science fiction film directed by Matt Reeves and written by Mark Bomback and Reeves. Sometime after the US military was called to fight off an increasingly intelligent and dangerous army of apes, the Apes Clan, led by the chimpanzee Caesar, is attacked in the woods by a military faction known as Alpha Omega. AO also has in its service apes who followed Koba, a bonobo who previously led a failed coup against Caesar. Some of the AO militants, including the Gorilla Red, are captured and reveal that Alpha Omega follows the leadership of a ruthless colonel. Caesar releases the prisoners as a peace offering to the humans, but makes plans to relocate the clan across the desert, not wanting to suffer any more ape casualties. The night before their journey, Alpha Omega infiltrates the ape space and the colonel kills Caesar's wife, Cornelia, and their elder son, Blue Eyes. Leaving behind his younger son, Cornelius, Caesar departs to exact revenge on the colonel. He is accompanied by Maurice the Orangutan, Luca the Gorilla and Rocket the Chimpanzee, while the other apes head for the desert. Caesar's party confronts traitorous albino gorilla Winter in an Alpha Omega camp and learn that the colonel has departed for a location called the Border. Caesar inadvertently kills Winter, which causes him to worry that he is becoming like Koba. During their journey, they encounter a man living in an abandoned village and kill him when he reaches for his rifle. After discovering his daughter, who is apparently unable to speak, Maurice insists that they take her with them. Further along, they discover some Alpha Omega soldiers who have been shot and abandoned. Their examination of a survivor reveals that he, like the girl, cannot speak. Later the group meets Bad Ape, a chimpanzee hermit who lived in the Sierra Zoo before the simian flu pandemic. Bad Ape directs them to the border, a former weapons depot that was turned into a quarantine facility when the virus first began to spread. When the group arrives at the border facility, Luca is killed protecting Caesar from an Alpha Omega patrol, motivating Caesar to proceed alone. However, he is captured by Red after witnessing the rest of his ape clan being forced to build a wall with no food or water. The colonel reveals to Caesar that the simian flu virus has mutated and now causes humans who survived the original strain to become mute and regress back to a primitive state, and that he is barricading himself in the facility to fend off rival military forces coming to defeat him because he favors killing any infected humans including his own son to stop the spread of the virus. While Caesar is tortured with starvation, the mute girl, whom Maurice names Nova, sneaks into the facility to give him food and water. To prevent her from being discovered, Rocket allows himself to be captured as a diversion. Together, Caesar and Rocket are able to work out a means of escape via an underground tunnel that leads out of the facility. Maurice and Bat Ape use the tunnel to rescue the apes, and Caesar orders the others to escape while he goes to confront the colonel. As the facility comes under attack by the rival military forces, Caesar reaches the colonel, but realizes that he has been infected by the mutated virus. Caesar ultimately spares the colonel, who takes his own life rather than exist as an infected primitive. During the battle between Alpha Omega and the rival militants, the escaping apes come under fire from Alpha Omega. Caesar attempts to attack Alpha Omega from behind, but is shot by Preacher, one of the AO militants he had previously set free. Red saves Caesar's life at the cost of his own and Caesar blows up the facility's fuel supplies, causing a cascading explosion which wipes out Alpha Omega and allows the rival militants to triumph. However, the human forces are subsequently buried by an avalanche, which Caesar and the other apes, carrying Nova, survive by climbing nearby trees. The remaining apes depart the facility and cross the desert to find a paradise-like oasis. While the other apes joyously celebrate their new home, Maurice discovers Caesar's wound, and assures Caesar that he will be remembered as Caesar quietly dies.